Yo, what is up guys, Botrix here, back with a brand new video, and today guys, we're going to be playing some Ceramic Crucible, so let's hop right into it, and as you guys can see by the title of this video, we are going to be trying out a Cobra Strat, which I freaking never, ever, ever use Cobra Strats, I actually did mention this in one of my most recent streams, and the Strat we're going to be going today is Tack Mortar Cobra, guys, I'm telling you guys, this can actually freaking work. Uh, pretty much like the tack, you can defend pretty much any mid-game rush. It can defend round 20 easily. Well, not easily, but it can defend round 20. It can defend round 22 all out. It can defend round 24 all out. So I think it's a pretty good goddamn strat. So today, we're going to be trying it out, seeing if it's going to be working for us. And this is actually my first game today. No, I lied. Okay, I played one game before this, but this is my first game with this strat. So we're going to see how it goes, ladies and gentlemen. Where is the Cobra, though? Ah. Uh, I can never find the Cobra. This is actually a pretty good map as well. Snowfall. I'm pretty happy with this map. Uh, so I'm sorry that I'm like clicking everywhere. I cannot find these freaking towers because I just never use the Cobra strat. But there we go. We're going to refrain from using our force, of course. So let's just hop right into it. And also, guys, if you guys do not know, I'm going to be streaming today at around 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. So you definitely don't want to be missing that. You could be potentially watching this right now. And I may be streaming live. Live as you're watching. So, of course, we're going to need... To get up our Cobras, I'm sorry, I just kind of forgot right there. Uh, but we're going to get up two Cobras with wired funds. If he does want to send us some stuff, that's completely fine. We can build up a mortar for our group popping power. But let's get that. And of course, we're going to uh, start to eco. That's what you have to do with the Cobra Strat. He's sending quite a bit of reds at us, actually. And he's not supposed to be. That's kind of dumb, but I will get this. Oh, God. Okay, let's uh, clean up some of those leaks there. So we did leak a couple of lives. I'm not really too worried about it, though, because he should not be ecoing. This is just not efficient for his farming whatsoever. His farm is going to be trash. He got up the grape shot as well, because uh, we're going to be continuing to send him to freaking eco. So let me uh, change my mortar spot back over there, and let's send him some blues. He's definitely not going to be able to defend. He's going to have to get up a faster shooting. Oh, no faster shooting goes for the next farm interesting my friend so he definitely is gonna leak even with the faster shooting so i don't know what this man's gonna do he's gonna build up another grape shot okay all right all right i see you i see you wisteria man i see you. i like the name by the way wisteria that's a pretty cool name in my opinion but of course like i said just continue to freaking eco you don't want to build up any more cobras until you stop ecoing and sometimes you can kind of get away with ecoing around eight and nine especially with a strat like this because we have the tack to defend any mid game rush so we might actually just eco just a little bit harder uh just so he's more influenced to rush us on round 13. Uh, so we definitely will be doing that. I mean, I have to kind of show my tack, though, which kind of sucks. Uh, so I'm not going to know what to do about that. So he probably <laughs> will not rush us round 13 to be smart. Uh, and knows that the tack can defend around 13 pretty easily. Uh, so it looks like he's going to be sending us some space blocks. I'm actually going to set these bad boys too strong uh, real quick. There we go. And he's actually going to boost to my eco. What? Okay, what? Okay, so we're going to leave a couple lives on those blocks, but I'm not too worried. Uh, I just wanted to set those too strong because they're going to be a lot better and strong for us definitely so we leaked down to 64 i'm not like i said i'm not worried i'm not freaking worried whatsoever see he's going to continue to send these blacks what in the hell man what in the hell so we're going to easily be able to defend against those how are we still leaking what the bernie stuff should be in that shit that's weird that's pretty weird guys so maybe i might not eco that hard because i am down to 52 now i'm starting to worry a little bit uh because that would be pretty unfortunate if we died like round eight or nine i don't want that to happen and look at this guy's farms by the way like they are trash bro i mean trash so i'm gonna stop equaling right here and we might have to boost this boys oh my god we have to boost this boys we had to we had to boys we had to it's all good it's all good oh my god regen heck no no thank you <laughs> okay so i'm greeting so hard against this guy let's get up a blade uh shooter right there and we should be able to defend against like anything that he does send uh if needed we can tack so i'm not really too worried about that he's actually wow he's sending us quite a bit Hopefully we can defend against this. I'm thinking we can, but we're going to leak down so low. So freaking low, ladies and gentlemen. Jesus, dude. Your farms are trash. Very, very trash, dude. Oh, my God. Okay, so I'm just going to keep the defenses I have right now. And we're going to kill them to adjust me. 110%. So let's get up that as well. He's going to try to send us a rush here. So I'm just going to get ready for that because I'm not dying to this guy. No freaking way. Regen pinks. What? What? I was actually kind of scared, not going to lie to you guys. Uh, but we should be able to defend against that. And we did down to 12 lives. 
Oh, Jesus. Okay, so yeah, we should send him a letter as well. I wasn't even paying attention. My bad, boys. Oh, he's gonna be trying to all at us, I guess. Uh. Um. Oh, jeez. I'm gonna boost that. Um. I guess I just send him a pretty decent sized rush because he's not defending. There's no way he's gonna be able to defend that rush. So, GG, my friend Wisteria. I know freaking clue what this guy was doing. I don't know what his game plan was. But, like I said, GG, my friend. I'll see you guys in the next one. So, we're back with the next opponent. Player definitely does not look good. But, guys, this is what you get with CC, guys. There's nothing else today. So, I do apologize uh, for the lack of like good opponents, I guess. But we got Battle River. Okay. All right. I might actually skip this. Uh, yeah, let's skip it. Let's try to get a better map. Hopefully, we get a better map. Temple. Oh, God, dude. This is not going to be a good map for this. We're going to try it out anyways. Let's freaking do it, guys. Let's freaking do it. Because this guy is not that experienced as a, as a player as well. So, hopefully, we can pull through with the fast one. Not, well, not the fast one. I kind of want to adjust this guy just to show you guys the adjustment and everything and how powerful it is. In case you don't know how powerful or the strength of the Cobra is, dude. It's amazing if you can use it effectively. Definitely, definitely, definitely. So, of course, we're gonna start off with our Cobra. We can probably build it about right here. Seems to be a good spot. And yeah, he has no idea what he's doing. He's setting down an Engineer at the beginning of the map. So, I'm not gonna kill this guy round 13, okay? I'm going to show you guys the adjustment. He probably, most likely, will die to that. So, he did anti-stall right there to where we could not get up the wired funds, which is not a big deal. So he's going to be sending us some eco. We're going to be sending him some eco. So we're going to have to get up definitely a mortar here soon. Uh, so let's chill on the eco a little bit and just wait up for us to get up the mortar. Wow, he sells. Oh, that's great, dude. Okay, so we got up the mortar. We're going to leak a couple of lives there, uh, but I'm not really too worried about it. So let's just continue to eco. He built a wizard down at the bottom okay that's definitely a much better position and you also got up the lightning so i guess he's going to be ecoing at least he knows to eco like i'm proud of you to know that dude and maybe i should have probably set down my cobras a little uh bit downward i guess if that makes any sense uh because i don't know they're just not catching all the balloons that are going through which kind of sucks man so i'm probably gonna have to get up also the rapid reload because of these blues dude kind of sucks that he's ecoing against us because it's just not good for our motor whatsoever because this is probably the best motor spot and he's going to be sending us these oh my god let's hit these on strong boys uh oh god okay so we got those on strong we're definitely going to leak a shit ton of lives so i'm actually going to set down two sets of attacks because he's probably gonna constantly and i mean constantly send these ladies and gentlemen so this kind of sucks uh yeah okay so he's just going to constantly send these we're going to probably have to get up the burning stuff here uh, because it doesn't really bother me actually because we have a way higher the eco than this guy a hundred and freaking ten percent So I'm actually gonna boost blacks to this guy because I am done I'm done with you with your space eco take my space eco and go ahead and boost to that Please and thank you most likely will boost to this because he just will panic because he's gonna start leaking some lives here He should at least come on Come on. Wow. I'm impressed dude. I'm gonna still continue to send these. Oh my god. Okay. That kind of sucked for us, but we got him to stop ecoing. We still have a higher eco than him, definitely. Uh, so we're just going to continue to eco right here. And we don't want to die on round eight. So I'm going to be a little bit cautious this time uh, because this just mortar spot's not the greatest on this map. Definitely, definitely not the greatest. So, of course, we got 480 eco, not the greatest, not the greatest. But he did stop ecoing, like I said. So I'm going to get up my tack right about here. Seems to be a good position for the tack. So. It's not the perfect position, I'm not, I'm sure, but it's not a huge freaking deal. So we might have to boost this boy, so we're going to just boost this, stay on the safe side, uh, so we don't die, because he's sending, oh my god, region yellows, Jesus, thank god we boosted this, oh my god, he's still sending, Jesus, man, I just really want to kill this guy around 13 now, but I, I guess I won't, okay? I won't, guys, I won't, I won't do it because of you guys, okay? Because I want to show you guys how freaking OP the adjustment is, and he's going to be sending us even more, god damn it, dude, come on. Come on, that's not cool, man. That's not cool. That is not cool, my friend. Okay, so I'm going to start off, uh, start building up more wired funds. I only had one wired fund. Oops, I forgot to buy the other one. My apologies on that one. We're going to have to just build it up here now. We just did and get up another one. And he's sending us a lead. Why? Why, dude? Okay, hopefully he doesn't all out me round 13. You know what? I, I won't even care. I won't even care. All out me and I will just defend and then continue on with the game pretty much uh, so this is where you start building up more cobras as well because i didn't do that last game because he was just being really really aggressive towards me uh so this is where you want to start building up more cobras uh so we definitely have to get up some camera detection though so let's get up the single flare i'm gonna have our camera detection down at the bottom and um if he does all us we just have to sell all our cobras get up a maelstrom and we'll be freaking 
good and maybe even boost just to be on the safe side okay so ooh, okay yeah so we're just going to maelstrom this 100 percent because look how many balloons that is dude that's not that's no 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 we're not dying to that boys we are not gonna die to that so uh oops oopsies going to spam these cobras once again guys and we're probably gonna have to adjust him here very very soon uh because we have Okay, so we have six Cobras. Not bad. So yeah, I'm going to start addressing him on round 16, actually. Oops, I accidentally just bought a balloon adjustment. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Okay, one of the balloon adjustments is not going to hurt us whatsoever. So here, boys, we're going to start to adjust him. I'm sorry for the cut right there, but I had to start adjusting him now, and he's most likely not going to be able to defend. I see that he's spamming the wizards at the bottom. I'm not too sure why he's doing that, but that's not a smart thing, and he's most likely going to die to round 18 adjustment. I can just see it out of this man. So I'm going to, do, going to even build up even more Cobras. Oh my god, what am I doing? I keep on misclicking stuff, dude. I keep on misclicking. We can also send him a mob to where he's going to die. Uh, so we might do that, that as well. Uh, so we are actually close to freaking leak. Oh my god. Nope. No thank you, man. No thank you. Okay, we leak down. Oh jeez. Don't die to that, please. Okay. <laughs> Alrighty. Okay, so we're definitely going to be sending him a mob because we have the power to send him a mob. Oh, I'm just going to boost that right there. Uh, so we don't die to that because that would be pretty bad and we have like no lives. Uh, so he's most likely dead to this, boys. He's most likely freaking dead to this. He's going to actually boost. But with the adjustment in the mod, there's just no freaking way he's going to be able to defend. No way. Even with two Dragon Breaths. I don't see it. I don't see it, man. I don't freaking see it. No way in heck. Oh my god, he does defend. This guy is clutch as fuck. But with the adjustment, no way, dude. Three Dragon Breath is not going to be enough, man. No way, dude. No way, man. There's just no way. Okay, I'm going to have to get up more balloon adjustment. <laughs> Jesus, dude. Oh, my God. He's clutching this with six lives. Dude, this guy's a freaking goat. This guy is the goat. 110%, dude. Hopefully, we don't die to these leads. That would be pretty bad. I'm going to actually boost that. Because that was actually pretty freaking bad right there. Oh, my God, dude. Oh, my God. This is not looking good for us, boys. How is he defending with this many lives? So, I'm actually going to send him another. I'm going to boost this one at him with some leads. Hopefully this kills him. Hopefully this kills him. Oh no. Oh no, boys. Oh god. Oh no, please die first. Oh my freaking goodness, guys. G G dude. Like I said, you don't want to be going that shot on that map. That is not a map that you want to be going that shot. So that's kind of why we almost took the L right there. But still, it's a great game. I'll see you guys in the next one. So we're back with the last opponent. Sorry for you. Okay, I'm sorry for you, my friend, because we're about to go Cobra Attack Mortar on you, dude. It's unstoppable, man. It's unstoppable. So we got Ice Flow. We definitely don't want to be having a map like this. So I'm just going to hopefully wait for him to skip this. I mean, okay, he's crying. Okay, he's crying. That means he wants. He doesn't want to play this map. Come on. Please. Please just skip it, my friend. Just skip it. It's just easy. It's very, very easy. Okay, he's not going to skip it. So we're just going to skip this. God damn it, man. Hopefully, I pray to God we get a good map. Okay, this could actually work on this map. And I will show you guys. Oh, no. I guess I won't show you. Yin Yang. Ah, oh, my God. Another freaking bad map for this strap. But, dude, we ain't complaining. Okay, we're not complainers. We're not known as that guy. Okay, we're not going to pull the excuses, dude. We're just going to take whatever we can get. Okay, let's freaking get it, guys. This is not... A map you want to be going this strat on once again but it is cc opponents and i want to show you guys uh how the strat is used unfortunately like the last strat oh my god i don't even know what that guy was doing and he was somehow defending and it was just weird i don't freaking know it that game was just a really fucking weird last game uh so of course we want to get up some cobras so let's get up some cobras here we want to get the wired funds on two cobras at least but we don't want to be anti-stalling which kind of sucks though because we're pretty much anti-stalling on this map uh, there's nothing we can really do about it. So, oh, he's going to be Cobra. What? What? He's farming and using Cobra? Oh, God, you're not going to like my group reds, man. I don't know. I don't know what he's going. Cobra Mortar Farm? If he's going Cobra Mortar Farm. Oh, God, man. Boomer? What in the... Okay, maybe... I don't know. He probably does not have any idea what he's doing, dude. But he's... Oh, oh, my God. He boosted to the group's reds, dude. The group reds. They're too freaking overpowered, man. They're just too overpowered. There's just no way you can defend against them. Oh my god, he sells the farm in order to defend against the grouped reds, dude. Just too overpowered. Man, they need to be taken out of the game 100%. I hope you guys agree with me. <laughs> all right, all jokes aside, wow. We are outplaying this guy by a lot. We also have a freaking huge eagle lead on him. He has no farms. He's going to facepalm me or himself. I'm not too sure. 
Um, but we definitely have an advantage on this man, which is a great, great, great thing. Uh, so we want to keep these two Cobras. You don't really want to build up more than two Cobras. I mean, I've seen people build up three, maybe even four sometimes, uh, but nothing over four, definitely, uh, before rounds 10. You don't want to be building any Cobras, really. Uh, so we're just going to stick with these Cobras. We might have to get up the Mortar here soon just to help us out, defend with this AI, because it's getting pretty intense for our Cobras, dude. It's getting pretty... Oh, my God, what... Okay, let's get it there. Okay, I had to stop there for a second because I was just, that was weird for the targeting. I don't know what was happening right there. Uh, but it looks like we are leaking a decent amount to AI, which is annoying. We're going to get up the rapid reload. Hopefully that will help us out a little bit. But like I said, this is not the greatest map for this strat uh, because we have a shit, and I mean a shit mortar spot, definitely. Uh, so that kind of sucks. But I'm not here to complain, guys. I'm not here to complain. No excuses, man. We're still going to win. I am confident that we can win. He actually has a plantation, which I'm actually surprised that he has that. So props to you, sorry for you. Props to you. Ooh, and a 1-0. Okay, I'm I'm freaking I'm ecstatic for you, dude. You're you're farming pretty well. You know? I did not expect you to farm this freaking hard, man. So we got 532 eco before round eight. Pretty freaking good in my opinion. So I'm gonna actually refrain from ecoing anymore. And I'm going to get up the Bernie stuff here so we don't die to a round 8 rush. That would be pretty bad. Also, probably want to get up my attack. All right, so we sent a bit more yellows, but we were easily able to defend that. Uh, we, we did lead down to 63, actually, so that's kind, kind of bad. So we can, with our defenses right now, we can start to build up more Cobras. I mean, we're going to get in more money. I did say not to build up any Cobras before round 10. I actually take that back. You can build up more Cobras before round 10. There's no troubles in doing that. So... Let's start to build up some more Cobras, but we want to watch out for round 11. So we're going to get another 0-0 tack right there, just in case if he wants to send us to round 11 rush. Uh, so we're ready for that. Um, but we're going to have to also get up the single flare. Let's get up the bigger blast as well. So it just has an increased range. So it makes sure to get every single camo that's on the map. Uh, but let's just keep on building up these Cobras, boys, uh, because it looks like he has no signs of rushing us because what can he rush us with? We can defend any freaking rush with this strat pretty much. Uh, so let's just continue to build up all of these wild funds, dude. This is how you use this strat, boys. This is the game, actually. I mean, this is not the ideal map, but look at how many freaking wild funds they have. This is actually in freaking insane. His defenses are not the greatest, uh, definitely not the greatest for the balloon adjustment that has about to occur to him on round 16 so i feel bad for this man dude we have so many freaking cobras dude but we gotta watch out actually we kid or should watch out for ceramics definitely don't want to be dying to those that would be pretty bad but we had the maelstrom ability just in case we also just have to sell some cobras in case we want to Ooh, okay so he's going to be rushing us with some zebras i'm actually going to be maelstroming this uh just to stick on the safe side probably once again right here oh Okay, that's actually not that bad. Okay, let's go. Let's get uh, some of these balloon adjustments up, boys, and we should be pretty good. Okay, let's get up the blade shooter right here. Uh, let's also get one right here just to help out. And we were late to a balloon adjusting him because he did send us a rush, so it was just kind of thrown off from that. But there's no big. That's no. It's no big deal, boys. No freaking big deal. We also probably will send him a mod as well because that will scare him, probably cause him to boost something like that. Uh, so we are leaking to AI, which kind of sucks. God. Damn it, AI. Just too OP for me. Uh, so let's send him a mob here. Come on. Come on. Okay, so if he does send us a mob, we're probably going to have to spam tax. So we should, probably should get ready for that. He's actually worrying about the balloon adjustment on his side, though. He had to turbocharge. Uh-oh. He had to freaking turbocharge. Hopefully we can defend against AI. Um, and it looks like we can defend. He does end up boosting. He's down to 60 lives. He's going to be able to defend. No, he goes down to the balloon adjustment. And also with what we were sending him with the mobs and the lead. So I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Make sure to drop a fat like on the video if you didn't. Also, if you haven't already, make sure to click that subscribe button. So the last question I asked you guys in the last video was, do I prefer Nuketown or Tilted Towers? And the answer is Nuketown. So this guy, what are the man? Dude, Call of Duty is the greatest and i mean the greatest game of all time there's there's just no there's no freaking comparison no no question about it i mean i hope you guys don't think fortnite is a better game than call of duty because that oh dude that game changed my life for the better and forever so i love nuke sound way more than tilted towers i know my name is tilted towers which is kind of funny uh but maybe i might change my name to newtown now
but congratulations, man, on your shout out. So the next question I'm gonna be asking you guys is, blondes or brunettes, make sure to leave your answer down below in the comment section. You may have the chance to win a shout out in the video. By that question, I mean, what do I prefer more within a girl? But other than that, that's gonna wrap up the video, boys. It's been your boy, Botrix. Peace out, everybody.